Arthritis is a common and non-specific disease. Patients feel pain, swelling, and stiffness on joints since the variant pattern. The incidence rate of arthritis is about 20%. And among the cases of arthritis, rheumatoid arthritis is a chronic inflammation and destructive autoimmune disease in 1% of the population. Nowadays, the main diagnosis of rheumatoid arthritis is based on the detection of rheumatoid factor and antibodies against citrullinated protein antigens. However, there are still more than 30% of arthritis patients who can't be accurately diagnosed by RF or ACPA. We know that the association of rheumatoid arthritis and the periodontitis is very high. The breakthrough of our discovery is that we find a peptide from bacteria, which is the autoantigen of rheumatoid arthritis. Using this ELISA system, we can increase the positive rate of rheumatoid arthritis test from 66 to 87 percentage. Almost 20 percent increase compared to the traditional test. First, Using this system, we can promote early diagnosis and the early therapy for rheumatoid arthritis to avoid disability of this devastating disease. Second, we develop a better test for the diagnosis of rheumatoid arthritis. This result shows that the anti-BR1 detection kit can increase the sensitivity of diagnosis in rheumatoid arthritis. And if BR1 becomes a third serologic detection in clinical trials, the sensitivity will be increased and will be supportive for clinical diagnosis of rheumatoid arthritis. Moreover, since nearly 50% double negatives of BR1 and ACPA patients can be detected by the anti-BR1 detection kit, this kit will be supportive for rheumatoid arthritis patients to get appropriate therapy earlier. This will create a value chain for the medical industry that enhances rheumatoid arthritis.